Math Appreciation Week is probably equivalent to having Dentist Appreciation Week. <laughs> you know, can you imagine how many people would want to celebrate that? <laughs> and, and there's a similar attitude about mathematics. You know, it's something that people, most people don't enjoy, but why should they? Many things you did today would have been possible without mathematics. People just don't know how many ways it touches them. Being a mathematician is more like being a philosopher. Um, you know, that's why we need things like math appreciation, because people really don't know what it is. And I'm sure that throughout the history of math appreciation weeks, you may have only won maybe one or two converts who thought it was worth appreciating. It's just not something people warm up to. My favorite numbers? Well, um, I mentioned one. It's a multiplicative identity and the loneliest number, according to Three Dog Night. One is the loneliest number that you ever do. Um, two, the only even prime. Seven, number of continents, days in a week, colors in the rainbow. In writing numbers one through nine, eight is the only number that ends on an upstroke. 1983, the year I met my wife. That's, I didn't know I was so romantic. Do <laughs> uh, you know what it is? You know why people don't like math? Someone didn't show them it could be fun. Mathematicians, I guess, they deserve to be celebrated because not too many people love them.